Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nick. As always, you can call me Tetra Ninja, and we are once again back playing some Fallout 4. We're continuing on with like the quote unquote side quests, but I don't really consider them side quests for me personally because they I feel like they offer a lot of background story stuff. So we're on Turn Back the Fog, where we need to head to Echo Lake Chamber. This is the closest one that we had in terms of a fast travel point. And we're gonna get along our way here. Personally, I kinda I get that the whole thing is that it's foggy, but yeah, I kind of wish I could see everything. Some suit and per mutants going ham over there. What is this thing? Oh, here's the Eden Meadow Cinema. See what the radio has to say. Brittany's bait and tackle. Hey, this place sucks. God damn it. We ain't alone here. Oh, what the heck is that? A glowing hermit crab? Dude! Are you shitting me? Oh my god! What the heck? Is oh my god. Killed your mom. We're just getting warmed up. I think these guys are hunting the hermit crab too. Storm's coming in. Long fellow down. They all dead yet? God. Now that everyone else is dead, let's take a look at this hermit crab deal, man. Look at this thing. Jesus. Go Lake Lumber. Where are all the ghouls at? There must be like a secret compartment down or something. Have to come in during an acid storm, didn't I? Of course. Nice. Okay, maybe. Yeah. Something gonna be very depressing behind this door. What an asshole. What an asshole. I think I just jump on me, did you? Anything good? Oh my god. Fuck you. Oh, Lord. Whoops. Hmm. 
Okay. Hull breach. Do south of here. Okay, at least we're kind of in the same general vicinity and area. Mr. Handy Fuel. Wonder Glue. Oh, who the hell is this guy? You got them. You got them shambles. All dead. <laughs> Fog's quiet. The land's mine again. Uh, for what you done, you can leave. Leave before I need to go a-hunting and kill. Who are you? My name? My name. It's Malcolm. Malcolm. I own this land. Fog came and I didn't leave. Started breathing it in deep. Made peace with it. <laughs> Some people in Far Harbor would like to settle here. Maybe you could share? Shea! Uh, this is my land! Keep the outsiders away! Or... Ha! Let them come. Send them to me. <laughs> Send all of them to me. And then I'll hunt them, salvage their gear, cut the meat, then toss the remains for the fog. What do you say? Got caps. Make it worth your while. You're gonna eat them? Uh, belly gets so awful empty in the fog. To me, their meat, your meat, all of us are. No deal. Won't be party to murder. <laughs> well, I got no use for you. <laughs> the most anticlimactic fight ever. Okay. You are free to populate people of Far, far Harbor. Okay. What the heck is this Christmas tree all about? Also, this radio tower, though. I tried to let you walk away, man. You had to do it. You had to do it. Alright, where is this tower? Oh. Mirelurks. Mirelurks everywhere. Big ones, small ones, on the sides of your head. Use my gun, I need water. Oh my god, really? Wow. Okay, there you go. Oh, I can't use my gun right now. That was because my arm was busted. Must have been a glitch. Critical there. <laughs> Gotta find this. What am I looking for again? Is the Myler King. He's in Screech. Nope. There's one. The 
this cleared now? Not cleared yet. What's up here? This building looks like it's important. Get up there. Okay, forget it. Whatever. Alright, done that. Done that. Howard Dunbar. Let me repair myself here. Go better than Any new. This is a dirty job. The pay will be worth it. Might as well do this dialogue thing. Now that I'm here. Food. Stim packs. I got your Meyer alert carapaces. Finally, it's done. Everything that can be welded, duct tape, or super glued to the damn docks, all there. Listen, I'm sorry for chewing your head off about asking about my condition. Not used to talking about any of this. Whole islands falling apart. So many dead from the fog. Crabs, whatever. And I just keep wondering how many good weeks I have left. Three, four, two. Are you in any pain? Doc's given me something to treat most of the symptoms. Having a hard time keeping everything down, though. My energy level's not quite what it used to be. And it's only gonna get worse. You should treasure every minute. Leave it all on the table. It's hard. Things that used to bring me joy taste like ash. I remember the way things were. Before the news, I was powerful close to tossing the whole lot off my docks. But afterward, there weren't no point in defending my land. Let them come, I guess. And now watching them all squabble instead of lending a hand? Hell, a single finger to help. Don't they realize that all the bickering for just a little bit more is a waste of breath? Isn't there some way we can make things better? Figured I'd bequeath my land to everyone. I think we've lived alone on this island too long. With some common land, maybe a real community can be formed. Even if they have to be drug into it. I don't think it's that black and white. Nothing ever is. <sighs> After I get the carapaces installed, there's one last thing I want to do. You've been a real friend, Rubus. If you're willing to see it to the end, well, gotta get to work. Ooh. Oh, 30% of the target's damage and energy resistance. Dang. Huh. Hey. Yo. Hold on. You talk to Cassie Dalton? Shame with that. Take it one day at a time. Where the hell's the little girl? Oh, you're sleeping right here. I cleared the lumber mill for you. Wake up! Wake up faster. We gotta go see the captain. Here's your pay. People keep leaving the island. But now that there's land, land to call their own. They'll come back. My friends have already sent word. We're going to turn back the tide. You'll see. The fog. It's dangerous. Okay? The captain's gonna say, what the hell are you smoking, child? If you need it, the bait shop's got it. If you ain't armed, you ain't long for this world. Buy my guns now. Bertha. Excuse me, ma'am? Smalls. We got no time for you. The mainlander cleared out Echo Lake Lumber Mill. Why are we even talking to the captain about this? She's got things we need. We gotta get off the docks, Captain. If you give us some of those Acadian fog condensers, my friends are ready to homestead the lumber mill. The surviving is about more than taming fog. We gotta stay together, Bertha. But we're no good here. Harbormen need their own land. Something to protect and hold. I was wrong about you. What? Not you. You. 
Bertha knows this island better than you, Avery. We give folks some condensers, materials, and a chance to build defenses. And we'll survive all right. And thrive, even. Could this really work? I don't see why not. And even if it doesn't, instead of starving on a pier, they die on their own land. Give them the fall condensers, Avery. Well, I, I won't stop you, but until we deal with the children of Adam, settling the island again, it could blow up in Come, your face. Come, Bertha. You might want to check up on Echo Lake. Bertha's friends would no doubt welcome you. And take this. You never cease to amaze. Push back the fog. Captain Avery didn't seem too happy about welcome that Welcome to the bait shop. If you need it... Welcome to the ice cream shop. I'll buy you an ice cream. Any odds and ends, I'm your man. Okay. Fine, Howard Dunbar. Doesn't seem like he's too far away from here. Ah, oh, you there. Are you that detective I've heard about? Who said I was a detective? Mayor Avery said that someone new had arrived on the island investigating a missing person. That must be you. I haven't been able to find any of the local police force. The louts? I don't want to start a panic, but, well, we may have a murder on our hands and we need an outside set of eyes. Where did the crime take place? At the Cliff's Edge Hotel, just north of the town. Will you help us solve this heinous crime? Who's the victim? Well, we want to keep this out of the tabloids, but it's Ezra Parker, the financier of the hotel. Please, you must help us. Every moment we wait, our residents are at risk. Who are your employers? I shouldn't say out here in the open, but my employers are quite wealthy, as are the other patrons of the hotel. Will you help us? There may still be a murderer at large. Is this conversation on the clock? Oh, yes. Well, I suppose I do have a bit of petty cash on me that I could provide for your time. Will you help us solve this heinous crime? This type of investigation usually requires a retainer. Oh, you're a private investigator, not an employee of the state. Well, yes, then I suppose a retainer can be arranged. Will you help us? This... There may still be a murderer at large. We're getting paid in pre-war money here. If there may be a murderer, I'm gonna need some danger pay as well. I'm afraid that's all I have on me, but my employers are, well, rather wealthy and i can definitely put a word in for you will you help us there may still be a murderer at large okay i'll help oh thank goodness shall i guide you to the cliff's edge hotel now not yet ah you must have supplies you need to procure i shall wait for you at the edge of town mm, i feel like this girl's kinda out of her mind, as most of the computers are, does not know exactly what the times are like. The fact that she's paying me in pre-war money does not bode well. Alright. Gotta find this guy. Oh, Myler. He did. He did. Looks like Howard didn't make it. I'll have to repair the fog condensers myself. Eh, how hard can it be? Good thing I don't have to have like some sort of skill to do it. Was the last one. Hey, the water. Let's 
about to say. So I'm surprised I didn't get jumped by something. Oh, just the you chain already. Uncle Ken. We're back at the Cliff's Edge Hotel. This is where the Pearl wanted me to go. What if she is the key to opening this door and getting access to the vault? I'll do it right after I do this mission. I should, maybe should have grabbed her, but maybe I would have gotten rid of uh, Longfellow Deeds here. Some fog condensers. Okay. He's still alive. Pretty nice house. How the hell do I get in? Ah. You're coming with me. Go away! You see? You see those corpses? They're from me! Unless you're ready for the long walk, go away! You killed them all? By yourself? What? Just because I'm an old man, you don't think I can protect myself? Wrong! Your nephew's worried about you. He sent me. Mitch? My boy Mitch sent you? He was always a smart one. He sent me the fog condensers. Made it safe to breathe here. Glad to hear he still cares about his old uncle. But you... What? What have you done? They're coming! They're coming! What? What's coming? Who knows this time? I haven't reset my traps or repaired the defenses. Quick, do what you can with the workbench supplies. They'll be here soon. They're coming. Where are you hiding? That's a lot of guys. Where does this guy think he's going? He's trying to go for the flank? What's up? Now too. Shit. Fighting against nature here too. Oh shit. We got in. can here How you got my 
It's like hiding in the tree line. Come on. Is that good? All right, Uncle Ken is obviously not safe here. Not bad. Mitch was a good boy to send you. But still, time to go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Before you attract more of them. Mitch sent me to bring you home. Safely. Please, go to Far Harbor. This is my home. And what? You want me to huddle like a beggar in Far Harbor? I... I can't just leave. Just consider this a vacation. You'll come back later. When it's safe. You are so... persistent. Fine. You happy? You've chased me from my home. Ah. I'll pack my things. Yay, he's come.